All right, <laughs> pretty common problem. We got our gooseneck trailer here. Uh, never been used. I think they call this the BMW system or some damn thing like that. Anyways, you got to pull out on this lever here. As you can see, it's stuck. So what we've done is we've gone underneath. All right, so there's from the bottom side, I got lubricant 1540 mixed with WD. And as you can see, there's a spring, uh, focus, actuator spring. So that pin is currently stuck in there. We got some 1540 leaking all over the place. So I'm just gonna move that over, get it out on the rocks. So I don't make a mess of my driveway. So you can see what I've done is there's a pin down in there. Not this one, but there's one further down. I've just filled it up past that so that it'll seep around that. These just pull up for your um, chains to hook to. So I'm gonna go ahead and move this truck over just a smidge so that I don't make a mess of my driveway. Yeah, we've cleaned up our driveway. So I don't think this thing's been used for a, quite a while. As you can see it, this sucker don't even wanna move at all. All right, here we are under the truck. Just gonna give this a couple taps. Uh, you can see right there, that's how she all works. Just gonna give her a couple little love taps here. As you can see, it's been a while since this has been used. Pretty stuck. I don't know. Might need a little heat on there. Let her sit for a few hours and see if that rust will break free for us. Okay, so here we are. We're gonna go try this fifth wheel hitch. I actually forgot about it, or the gooseneck hitch. Um, we're gonna try pulling the lever. It's been a couple days. If not, I'm getting out of there and gonna beat the hell out of that ball that's underneath the truck and this seems to be pretty stuck I see that uh, spring up there be nice to be able to tap on that somehow. Okay, I'm gonna zoom in. You see that right there? That's how I that's how I ended up getting this uh, ball hit free. Took a bar. Oh, sorry guys. Took a bar. Put it in up there like that and pried it over you can see it moving so that's how i got this free and uh, now that i got it free i'm gonna lube the hell out of it work it back and forth see if i can get this sucker moving here get that ball hitch out so i can actually use this uh gooseneck hookup thanks for watching dns projects uh, if you wouldn't mind going down to that like and subscribe button be going through a whole bunch of crap that nobody else wants to deal with on pickups. Uh, whatever I'm dealing with, you get to see how I do it anyways. All right, thanks for watching. So there you have it. You can see, at least now we can get it working. Spring's working. Good. You just want to keep working it back and forth. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to put on there for lubricant. Definitely going to put something on there. 
it's definitely a hell of a lot better how it's stuck out. Yeah. Just keep working it back and forth. Put something on there. Okay, now that we've got it working, it pulls out nice. What I did was put uh, gear lube on there. Now it's just getting the freaking thing. Normally it should just slide over and then lock for you. So you can pull, go up top and pull the ball out. Shouldn't be this hard. So you just pulled over. There's the step we fixed. I'll see. So you know that's stuck in there. I'll get a pair of vice grips and see if I can pop this up. Okay, so there you see it. <clears throat> Got it out. That pin slides through there. We'll go pop that through. I'm uh, I'm actually gonna buy a new ball. Nothing wrong with that one, but. Uh, a lot of rust in here. I think I'm gonna go ahead and just leave it out for a bit, let everything kind of so we don't end up with that stuck problem again. We got her all working. There we go. That's how she works. Pretty rusted up. So uh, yeah, we'll look for a new new ball. As you can see, they just flip, goes in this way. You don't want to see it. Goes that way. That's how this was stuck. Uh, it was seized in there a bit. We had to smash that with a hammer to get it out. Thanks for watching DNS Projects. If you wouldn't mind going down to that like and subscribe button.